Just watched the last three wins in a row. Uh, what turned around in form first and foremost? Uh, How was everyone feeling? Obviously buoyant and like I said, that bit of confidence and belief in ourselves now. Um, starting to really feel like our, our old selves from last season in the way we play and the manner we're going about things. So that's really pleasing. Like I said, turn, turn the form right around and, and now we're looking at, up at the right end of the table. What starts off is easy for yourself. That's eight goals, we made three assists. Can't start like you for it. Yeah, no, really pleasing. Um, like I said, I'm not really focused on numbers um, at this moment in time. As long as whatever I'm doing is, is contributing to wins and points on the board, I think that's ultimately my goal and what I want to uh, help the team with this season. So if that's goals, if that's assists, if that's just general all-round play in either box, um, that's the most important thing. And like I said, it was a disappointing start, um, but just pleased to get through on the spin and, and like I said, get that momentum going into the next game. And how important of the lift has that been for um, the lads after the start that we had? Really important. You know, it's been, you know, make no bones about the, the sort of injury crisis we've had at the club and the lads have had to really group together and dig deep with a, a really weakened squad. Um, to get a couple of key players back has been good and we know we've got more to come back, which is which is a huge lift and, and give us even more confidence. So, um, like I said, we're starting to look a lot more like ourselves and it's the most pleasing thing probably. One of those players uh, back, Elliot, assisted you for the first today. Uh, how good it have you hit back in the heart of that midfield making things tick? Yeah, you know, it's, it's, not, a, it's not a surprise. He's, he's our probably most influential player, so you know, for him to snap up, I think every award going last season was, was a testament to him and his quality. And, obvious to see that we missed him for, for the first part of the season but to have him back and clicking and you, you know it's no surprise we're now winning so um, he's such an important player for us and, and keeping him on the pitch is going to be of utmost importance to us this season. Second goal quite a unique moment you don't see uh, that too often um, but quick break up the other side so what the initiative for us just to get things going again. Chose Brilliant I, I was stare, I was doing what the uh, the crew lads were doing I was staring at what was going on then next thing I know Lundy's breaking I thought bloody hell I better get myself in the box so you know good initiative I think it was Lundy that was said come on let's get going um, and like I said marched up the other end and got a goal so it's a bit of a sucker punch for them I'm not sure if it was offside or not I don't know but um, like I said we took full advantage of just being switched on more than anything. And then just a word on Kelly, um, obviously you guys on Tuesday linked up really well and you, know, you have another really good game this afternoon. As one of the older guys in the group and Kelly one of the guys coming through, how much of a role model or how much experience do you pass on to someone like Kelly at this point in his career? Yeah, of course, you know, he's playing alongside me. I try to take him under my wing as much as I can and give him bits of advice and Make sure he just keeps a level head, really, and, and, and stays in the game all the time. I think, like I said, the past two performances have been exceptional. Um, and he's a kid with a bright future. He keeps his head switched on. He keeps his mindset right. Um, you know, he's got lots of quality. So, like I said, hopefully uh, the past two games will really spur him on. I hope so. And, and like I said, he'll be a big, a big player for us if he keeps that vein of form.